And it's getting more and more a European dimension, a necessary industry, break through the cop with uh, the century energy changes, supported by EU policies, consistently aimed at strengthening the security of supply, fostering competition of the gas market and promoting the transition toward the low carbon emission. In this changing energy market, the development of a renewable surely impacts on, the share, on uh, the share of natural gas in the future energy mix. However, natural gas represents the cleanest among the fossil fuels and can play an important role in a sustainable and green energy system. Also, providing the primary backup solution to renewable sources. Gas is therefore a natural campaign on, on renewables for a sustainable energy mix. The achievement of this goal, however, requires an increase of the competitiveness of natural gas with respect to the other fossil fuels. In particular, with coal, to be rich also through a revision of the emission trading system scheme, aimed at the real CO2-based competition. With regard to the gas evolution, we have to consider that even if gas demand is not growing and will possibly grow less than anticipated in the recent years due to the European prolonged economic crisis, Several factors, such as the increasing import dependence of Europe, the worldwide ASEAN-driven competition for LNG, and the shale gas revolution require the development of new energy corridor to supply Europe and the better interconnectivity among regional markets. Transmission system, storage, and LNG terminals will continue to be designed, shaped, and developed for satisfying peak capacity required to ensure a secure, reliable, and sustainable response to final customer needs. Even more considering the higher volatility in annual dynamics, in other terms, gas infrastructure will be required to be more flexible than in the past. In this context, the role of gas infrastructure is significantly changing. Infrastructure developments will not only be driven by the growth of gas demand, but they will be more and more oriented to providing efficient services to the market, to promote the competitiveness of energy prices ensuring at the same time a better diversification of sources also through the bidirectional interconnection of EU gas markets and, but, but not least, the enhance the security of the gas supply. <coughs> the current excess of the take or pay obligation vis-a-vis -vis the gas demand, the increasing liquidity of spot markets and the introduction of new congestion management provisions pushed market participants to shorten their market perspective, increasing the share of spot supply and reducing their long-term commitment. In this new environment, it is crucial to get market and institutional support for the investment required to fulfill the flexibility needs of players the security of supply for customers, and the objectives of the European energy policy. We have to work for making this target feasible with an investment uh, climate granting investors with uh, adequate visibility of a future cash flow. New energy corridors and projects are required to realize this picture. A lot of them involves the Italian peninsula through which new south-north flows 
could be developed connecting North African countries. The new Caspian area and the Eastern Mediterranean gas sources and the LNG terminals to, continu to continental Europe. SNAM, together with other infrastructure operators, is highly committed to realize this picture in the interest not only of the Italian gas system, but of the European gas market as a whole. In this respect, the infrastructure that, uh, as recalled a few days ago by Commissioner Ottinger, represent the backbone of the gas system are not enough. New services and rules allowing for an optimal access and the utilization of the system by the commercial operators are necessary to promote the well functioning of the market and to foster liquidity. In this perspective, the role of infrastructure operators is also changing, evolving from a pure asset owner, which realize, operate, and maintain the infrastructure, to a market facilitator, which provides market-oriented services and focuses on quality of its output to the benefit of shippers and final customers. Building on the availability of bidirectional interconnection capacity and harmonized short-term services that favor arbitrage and price alignment among gas hubs, the, progress, the, the progressive introductions of hub-to-hub services and the possible development of new combined transportation, storage, and LNG flexibility services will boost the integration and the liquidity of the European gas market. A lot of work has already done by institutional regulators and infrastructure operators with the full support of market participants and much more is ongoing. GIE and ENSONG activities are giving a crucial contribution to the harmonization of rules and uh, services that can be implemented in all European countries. With a unique common language able to overcome the single national dialects. To conclude, we have entered a new phase of the gas market development characterized by high volatility and uncertainty, where the role of the infrastructure operators will evolve under the market pressure for significant changes <coughs> and innovations in the service offered. For this new age to turn into a new natural gas golden age, Several conditions have to be met by all stakeholders. And in exposing them, I would like to reverse the traditional order of responsibility, where we as infrastructure operators have, increased, have to increase our role in shaping the future of our business. For that, infrastructure operators have to design sustainable strategies and efficient projects that are attractive and shared by all shareholders. Policymakers have to clearly define the energy policy, the energy policy goals, and remove any obstacle to their achievement with a target for a real CO2-based competition among fuels. National and the European regulators have to responsibility have, to have the responsibility to continue working for providing stability, transparency for the evolution of the gas market, and support, not least in terms of return, the required investment and the development of additional products and services available to commercial operators. These represent a growth opportunity for the gas system that uh, we will achieve uh, if, you are, uh, if you are able to match uh, a well-functioning internal gas market with more uh, challenging targets on security of supply and quality of services provided 
to our final customers. Wishing you all a very beautiful, a very fruitful GIE annual conference and uh, a wonderful stay here in Venice. I have now the floor to the chairman of the coming session. Thank you very much for your attention.